Yeah. I can't find a In my bag. Hey guys, I'm Elijah Gaming here. Uh, today I wanted to talk to you about something uh, important. Um, I wanted to give a little info on about how you should treat girls and like how they need to be respected and you know if you want if you want their respect you gotta know that they want you like if they say you dated this one girl and you guys broke up you want to get back together with her right well you know I've heard stories about guys who like to harass or make that ex-girlfriend jealous. Well, in my book, that doesn't play out. Me, I respect girls. I don't do that crap. Um, honestly, you know, they want space. and I mean, I've seen... I, I'm still in high school, and... You know, high school, we're all pretty stupid. We do stupid things. Uh, well, you know, it's not... High school guys, they're really stupid. No offense to some of all of them, but... Uh, you know, everybody here and there needs to learn how, you know... how the girls feel how would the girl feel about you doing what you're doing to her and not just how you feel because how you feel doesn't really matter it's how the girl feels and you know it's important that we learn to respect a girl and give her her space and you know I know guys you tend to act like you're feeling lonely and crap like that well you know most of the time, you're just doing it because you want to have someone you can impress or, you know, have someone there you could make feel different, you know, but, uh, no, no. Me, I've, I've been single three years now during the whole my whole entire time in high school I've been single for three years now I'm proud to be uh, I know I know you guys some of you who don't have a girlfriend and your friends do and they talk about their relationships a lot and you can get like seriously jealous and you know jealousy is everything to everyone and I know that but me not all the time I'm not I'm not always that jealous person I'm always the me I'm a cool quiet calm guy who who likes to stand up for others and uh, make sure that you know everyone's doing fine not I'm not gonna be one of those idiots who go out there and make like the other guys look bad or try to be a show off um i've known people like that and they're it's pretty ridiculous and then i have it, you can't solve your problems as well with girls like if you have if you're trying to get through an issue and you're having a hard time dealing with you don't need to be going looking for a girlfriend just because you're having a hard time no you want you want you want to be with that girl because you know you want her in her life not because you're dealing with some stupid crap now uh you know respecting giving space and knowing what that girl wants or what she doesn't want you know what she dislikes what she doesn't like what she likes um basically you know
guys, I get upset when I see something happening or hearing something bad that happened to a girl. I mean, I've had friends of mine. I've had, I've dealt with issues between couples before and it's not fun. I mean, I got, I fixed their situations. Most of the time i am come to, to talk about advice with dating and all, but, you know, I'm not an expert or anything, but some stuff I do tell you is, is informational on what you would need to know, and, you know, I know, like I said, I'm just in high school, but three years I've been single, and, hey, you know what, I'm proud. I'm not, I'm not one of them guys that's like a dog who needs to have a girl in his life, you know. I know I'm, as the, uh, as an adult would say, that per, that right, that, uh, crap, how do they, how do they put it, uh, oh, crap, it's like, uh, it's like, uh, they say, uh, you know, you'll find that right person someday or something like that, and, you know, it, you know, I believe that because, you know, my mom, she's been, actually, I don't want to talk about that, no, no, I've known people who've, who've done, found their right someone who's perfect for them, and they've been together for a long time, and, you know, it, it's important that we do give girls respect and you know my channel I'm not always gonna be gaming I mean the only time you'll probably see me game is with Andy Andy's gaming uh, he's my half brother his real name's Jacob I'm not gonna tell you last name don't want you hunting him down or finding his location uh, But you'll see me play games with him on like Call of Duty Black Ops 3. It's about the only one I've played with him actually. Be truthful. Uh, I don't know if you watch some of his videos. He, uh, he puts up like trick shots and uh, stinking quick scopes and stuff like that. Uh, you know, and like. Completely off topic, I'm sorry. But yeah, anyways, uh, check his channel out, like and subscribe. Clayton Cam's my best friend. I've gotten him out of situations before, uh, especially not too long ago. Um, feel bad for the guy, but, you know, sometimes he needs to learn his lesson. And, you know, uh... I've helped him through a lot. He considers me as a brother. I I appreciate that, and it makes me feel good that I'm being called a brother to him. I have him and another friend of mine who call me brother because, you know, I'm I'm like a brother to them, and you know, I'm not I'm not a complete total stranger just because I'm quiet or or anything. You know, just because I'm quiet doesn't mean I'm weird or you know, angry all the time, or frustrated, you know, but girls, they need, they need a lot of respect, and the trouble with high school is, there's a, there's too much drama about this stuff, and, you know, they need all the help they can get, it's ridiculous, dude, I mean, I know there's guys out there, there's, like me that's out there that's you know wanting to make sure everyone's okay although you do have girls out there who who do the wrong and go for the wrong uh girls who like to go for the bad bad type of guys you know uh yeah it's bad it's terrible you know, and that's why they come to you in the end asking you to help and, you know, talk about it and, you know, help her 
through her situation have make them feel happy again that's all they want to do is feel happy to be with someone not feel like they're being ignored cheated on abused you know that's all terrible crap you shouldn't do that to a girl you know and you know i've i've been made fun of for not having a girlfriend by my half brothers and i don't really care about that i don't care that they make fun of about me not having a girlfriend you know i'm not like i'm not like my half brothers uh yeah but, you know talk to you more on the subject later on whenever i can i know it's been a while since i posted a video i'm sorry about that but you know i kind of i just i I have to come up with something, and this was something very important that I felt like I needed to talk to you about. Uh, you know, just stick up for girls who need help. Don't stand by there and watch girls get cheated on or abused. Don't let rumors go spreading around, you know? I mean, there's girls out there that are, are accused of going to multiple guys and it's high school's terrible let me tell you i don't i don't like high school i've been in high school this is my third year now i'm not too sure i'm i'm all i do is i stay quiet i even when you're quiet you can still listen to all the drama and let me tell you it's not pretty um You need to be there with your for your friends, for others, and you know, me and my friends, we started the anti-bullying club last year, you know, we didn't get really any respect while talking to people about why bullying is a bad thing and what we should do and what we shouldn't do, and you know, we've had kids, like, we'd, we'll be there in the classroom, we'll stand up front with our presentation. You got kids at the desk sitting there on their computers playing games, not talking to their friends, ignoring what we're actually trying to, like, get going here. And, you know, it's ridiculous. But, you know, like I said, respect girls. Be there for them when they need help. Uh, guys, don't be a suck-up. Don't be a sucker. That's not what they want. You gotta know what they want and what they don't want, you know? Sorry, I'm trying to keep my eye on my dog. She likes to get out of the fence. Uh, but, yeah. Anyways, uh, like and subscribe to me. I'm, I'm Elijah Gaming. Check out Andy's Gaming. Like and subscribe to him. Uh, Clayton Cams. Subscribe to him like his videos he does clayton 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 cams does blogs and he's well he's recently started uh a game series on in, infin, infinite infinite or whatever it's called i don't know what it's called uh uh andy's gaming he's done outlast whistleblower if you don't know what those games are they're pretty creepy you should check him out playing it you know he gets pretty scared i think it's funny when he gets scared uh yeah but like i said check us out and i'll be talking to you on the next video and i do have a nickname for you guys to call me call me smiley don't call me by my name uh, i'd feel much safer if uh, i was just called by my nickname smiley so yeah, talk to you guys later. Smiley's out.